Hi everyone. Welcome to the NAND Cloud Carriage. In this session, I'm going to talk about our home lab network connectivity and how to enable internet access for virtual machines in VMware ESXi host. So here is the network connection diagram. In my home lab, we have a home Wi-Fi router. So even the same way, if you have a home Wi-Fi router, the same Wi-Fi router generally it's connected with a wide area network port. So it's connected. Internet connection is established through home Wi-Fi router. And for my uh, ESXi host connections, I have a one TP link switch. So it's a normal switch. It's not a layer three switch, normal switch. To get the power to this switch, we connected to power adapter. And this switch is having a eight port switch, one to eight ports. And to get the established internet connection from the Wi-Fi router, we need to connect a LAN port, RJ45. We need to connect one connection from router to our lab switch. Once we connection uh, connection is established, the network is established with the internet access. And this internet access from the not only from port one, the internet is connected to until all the eight ports. So if you connect one port for ESX host, ESX also will get the internet access and same way ESX2, ESX3 and storage. And whatever the VMs we created on ESX1, 2 and 3, those VMs also will get the internet access. The reason is these connections are connected to internet switch and this switch also connected to our Wi-Fi router. Okay, so home lab network connectivity is pretty straightforward. There is no additional configuration involved. Only the key part is from the Wi-Fi router, we have to connect a LAN connection to our lab switch. Okay, and IP address maybe your home may have different IPs. Currently in my home lab, we are using IP address from the router, the same series, 192.160.10 series IP address. So the same IP series I have to provide to all our ESX host and storage access. And subnet mask is same for make sure it's the same for all the connect connectivity devices. And the another key part is gateway and wi-fi router will provide a gateway the same gateway only we can connect it to our mobile devices home laptops and also the tab all the devices also uses the same gateway the same gateway only we have to assign on our esx host level as well okay then only we can get the internet access okay hope you understand the straight away it's a pretty simple network diagram only the key part is from the switch to router we need a one lan connection Okay, that is only the key part. Okay, let's verify in our lab how we are getting the internet access. Make sure all systems connected to the 192.168.10.1 same gateway. So let me connect to the lab system. Let's say I connected to one of the system and, and from here I launched the vCenter server. Within our vCenter server, we have three ESX hosts, ESX1, 2, and 3. Suppose if I select ESX1 from the configure tab networking virtual switches we can see our ESX host management port is 10.81 either you can see from virtual switch virtual switches tab or select vm kernel and from the vm kernel also you can see our ESX host ip address is 10.81 that means the ip is within the 10 series ip 192.168 10.81 and ESX2 even ESX2 also same series 82 IP address and ESX3 also same series 83 IP address. And another key point is all our ESX hosts must be mapped with the same gateway address. So gateway address we can verify from under networking tab, select TCP IP configuration. You can see default IPv4 gateway address is 10.1. And even ESX2 also gateway is same. ESX3 gateway also same. Okay, and even if you select one of the virtual machine within our ESX host, we have one virtual machine DC01, domain controller 01, and it is running with Windows Server 2022 and IP address is 10.53. And the same system I connected remotely. And if you want to verify the gateway of the system, even you can type IP config, you can see this system also default gateway is mapped to the same gateway. When we map to the same IP series and also the same gateway, that means internet will work automatically. Suppose in the Google, if you type 
NAND Cloud Garage. See, our channel also able to launch. Internet is working as usual. Okay. So that is how I connected within our lab network and also the internet is coming through the home Wi-Fi router only. Okay. Because uh, this question I'm frequently getting from our, some of our viewers. That is the reason just for your understanding. I'm explaining this network diagram and how I'm getting the internet access to system even in the dc01 the same dc01 system only we connected if you see the host name we can see this host name is dc01 the same vm we it is running on esxi host okay you can see from command line or else open server manager and go to the local server the same server dc01 it is connected to gcglab.com so our uh, channel name, short name I used, GCG Grand Cloud Garage Lab .com. Okay, so the same system, DC01. It is running on ESXi host. Currently, the exact ESX host is, it is running under the ESX1. If I select ESX1, go to the VM tab, the same one, DC01. Okay. So hope you understand how we can get the internet access on the virtual machine. Even ESXi host, one key point is when I connect to the ESXi host using command line, let's say ESX2, make sure our ESXi host must be pingable to our local gateway address. Let's say 168.10.1. So it, it must be reachable state. And same way in all other ESX host also. 192.168.10.1. So gateway is reachable. That means no issues. Even in future, if you create any another VMs also, either Linux VM, Ubuntu VM, or other Windows VMs also, there will be no issues within the internet access when you maintain a same series of IP and same gateway. Okay. So internet also we tested. So Google also working. If you type any other thing, let's say vmware.com, see website is able to launch normally. Okay, so that's it. Thank you. If you're watching this video first time, please do view, like, share, and subscribe to the Gnan Cloud Garage channel. If you're already subscribed, I appreciate all your support. Okay, thank you. Bye for now.